When the journey begins, you never quite know who's going to be there at the end. Now only two teams left in the cup, and we're left wondering who's going to be lifting it. It's Inter, they take on Milan next on EA TV. Well, no doubt about it, the nerves have been jangling in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Inter facing Milan. Well, Derek, what a game this should be. Both teams have done really well to get this far, but who will be lifting the cup at the end of the game? I'm sure it'll be a classic, though. And a look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Romelu Lukaku. And here's how Milan will line up. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And the match begins. Barella has it. Lukaku. Will it be Lukaku? And the post getting in the way. Hide by the woodwork. Now the focus is on keeping the opposition at bay. A really vital interception. Well, so many reasons to highlight Lautaro Martinez, not least because he can be so effective. Oh, Derek, what a moment this could be. Oh, there is the goal that gives Inter the lead in the final. Exactly what they were hoping for. Look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And what an emphatic strike it is from Lukaku. Hit with his laces. It's a great goal. Teo Hernandez. Ben Asser. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Surely the equaliser. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. The ball with Martinez. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Oh, what an opportunity. Oh, it's in. They take the lead here. And just how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then the perfect finish from Lautaro. He really does hit this with power. That's an excellent goal. Well-timed tackle. Barella. 
Back with Lukaku. Can they convert? And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name of the trophy, maybe. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Lukaku. And here's Chalanolu. Lukaku! And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Play. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And then the finish from Lukaku demonstrates his ability to make the right run at the right time. What a good goal. Ben Asser. Teo Hernandez. Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Martinez. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. Well, Milan are controlling the possession, as you can see, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They oh, wait a moment, Stuart. Look at what's happening. Oh, and it goes! Another goal! And I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. The goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Barella. And back with Lukaku. And a very good challenge. Now can they counter clinically? Oh, in with a chance. And it's there for him. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Again, the speed of counter-attack is so impressive and Lukaku does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power, it's a great finish. Fluency of movement. Now this could really lift spirits. Chance maybe. Cross blocked. They've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas and then counter-attack quickly. Textbook defending inside the box. Fowler. Can he put it away? Well, they've solved the problem for now, but let's see. In it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Diaz, zero, and searching for his second. Martinez, keeping the opposition at bay with that splendid challenge. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Big chance to get them on terms. Well, what an opportunity. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Oh, a save. Of Ben 
Benasser. Oh, he looks threatening. Must be. Well, what a start that was. For a lead in this one. Stewart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, going forward, they've been excellent. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Gives it a go. Body in the way. Diaz. This could square the game. Oh, a goal to level it up in the closing stages. Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Bending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Attack and the game's waning moments still level. Real chance. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it. Really. Benassa in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the. Hendrik Mikitarian. Damian. Opportunity, Matteo Damian. Options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Real chance. It's in, and this really takes your breath away. A comeback and a half. He play. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Well, he's certainly not alone. Davide Calabria. He's got to score! To be advised, giving the ball away in that position. Tremendous block. Chance to finish! Well, that's it for the first period of there. Breaking at pace. Can they take advantage of the situation? He's blocked it! It's wholehearted... And short it is. Brozovic. Now Mikitarian. Oh, a smart stop. Short corner favoured. Brozovic. Can they convert? What an important piece of defence. Dzeko. This could square the game. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him sequence Rebic Rebic and a decent from this corner it probably would be the end of the story playing it short Barella Lukaku! Oh, a stellar piece of defending. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. 
Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. Yeah, really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.